Welcome in everybody. Little late night live action tonight. Um, I have to get some cross listing done before our trip tomorrow. We leave tomorrow morning and I have 77 total items that I need to cross list. So I thought it was a good idea to kind of show off auto posture a little bit and how fast it cross lists. So we're going to try to cross list 77 items in this live. So the first item I cross list, I'm going to go a little bit slow so I can kind of show how auto posture works. Um, and then we're going to cross list the rest. I'm literally going to try to focus mainly on the cross listing. I'll peek over at chat every now and then. So obviously this will be skewed a little bit because obviously I'll be answering questions too, but I'm going to try to cross list as fast as I can, 77 items on auto posture and see how long it's going to take. So let me preface this really quick um, before I get a bunch of questions about it. Auto posture isn't officially out with the cross lister yet. It will be out next week. I believe she's shooting for next Wednesday to do the full release. So if you like what you see, you can sign up for auto posture. There's a link. I'll put the link below in the description, or there's a link in my bio. If you sign up, you'll get $5 off your first month. You can get everything but the cross lister, including the inventory feature. So um, feel free to sign up, get the inventory feature. You can already have all your items downloaded. And as soon as a cross lister comes out, you can buy it. Um, but yeah, if you like what you see, um, it's not completely out yet. You can DM her and try to get access early. I'm pretty sure she's going to stop doing that here because it's going to get released anyway next week. But I figured this would be a good idea to kind of just show you guys how fast auto posture is, how accurate it is, um, how well it works, all that good stuff. So um, also all my inventory has already been downloaded into auto posture. So clearly that takes a little bit of time too. So whenever I finish this, just add on an extra, you know, two minutes for how it, it, that's how long it takes to download like 80 listings into auto posture. So, um, add another two minutes on, and I guess that will be the official time. So who's faster, Wiley Coyote or the, I am clearly faster. The roommate is clearly faster. Um, okay. So let me share my screen really quick, show you what auto posture looks like. Um, and again, if you're interested in purchasing it, there's a link in my bio, all that good stuff, get $5 off first month or use code KWA shop at checkout and you'll get $5 off first month. Um, all right. So this is the inventory feature. I have 77 items. The way I know I have 77 items is because there's 20 items per page. I'm on page four and three of the items have already been cross listed as you can see. Um, so let's cross list one item slowly so I can kind of show you how it works. And then from here, we're just going to cross list. I'm just going to focus on cross listing. I'll peek over at chat every now and then. Um, but we're pretty much just going to cross list. So if I get quiet, <laughs> this might be the quietest live you see me on because um, we might just focus on cross listing and you know if chat's not going I'm just going to keep clicking away so it's kind of like a work with me live almost so let's cross list this Lululemon piece really quick first we go to Mercari I always do it first Mercari first and then Poshmark last as you can see it's been downloaded from eBay so all the information gets imported into this function every time I cross list we're going to go down as you can see the brand wasn't put in same thing happened on um on list perfectly when I use list perfectly because it uses Lululemon Athletica and then um, eBay uses Lululemon. So sometimes you got to change that up. Everything else here looks good. So we're going to go ahead and list. So this one is listed. All the information was put in correct. Easy to tell. You just scroll through it. Um, easy to do. Also, this might take a little bit longer to cross list than it normally does because obviously I'm streaming. So typically it's a lot faster, but um, I'm streaming right now. All right, next one is put in. Everything looks correct. As you can see, the brand came in incorrectly, so we're just gonna fix that really quick. Lululemon Athletica, again, because it has Athletica on the other two sites and not Athletica on eBay, it imports it differently. Um, everything else is put in correctly, so we're gonna go ahead and cross list. Easy peasy, that's the first two. All right, so from here on out, that's 76 that I have less, left to do. What time do we have on here? We have four minutes and 10 seconds. So let's see how fast we can get 76 listings done. So I'm just going to literally list away. I'm going to use the same process I usually do. I usually skip the top part because everything is put in correctly in the top part. I've never found anything incorrect in the top. It's always the bottom that you have issues with, um, but this is all put in correctly. So we're just going to list. And this is how fast it is to cross list. It's crazy, crazy fast. It's our leggings, our women's small, Mercari list. As long as you have your weights put in correctly on eBay, your weights should be proper on Mercari. There is some instances where I up the weights just to be safe on Mercari, but if I know the weights are correct, then I'll just go through and list. So that's one full listing done. I don't know how many minutes we're in, but we're just gonna, actually two listings done right there. GP, 
Everything looks good. What are these pants? Yep, they're pants. So 15 ounces should be fine. I always double check the weights. Um, yeah, because I just want to make sure. On Mercari, when you sell something, I don't believe you can adjust the weights. You might be able to. I've never, I haven't used Mercari shipping too much, so that might be wrong information. Um, but I just always like to be extra safe with Mercari. So our shorts. Everything looks correct. North Face, cargo, everything's good. I think I might start cross-listing Mercari tomorrow. Um, do you get a lot of sales on there? Yes, I actually got two sales today on Mercari. Um, one was a um, item that I cross-listed earlier today. Um, it was a women's free people piece. And then um, the other one was um, a Lacoste polo. So for $22.99, pre-owned Lacoste polo selling for $22.99. Can't beat that. Can't beat that. As you can see, everything's put in correct, so I'm literally just going down and hitting list. This should all be, if the Mercari's correct, usually Poshmark is correct. Um, the only one that's different with that is Ralph Lauren items. Sometimes it imports it as Lauren Ralph Lauren, so you have to check. Um, that used to happen on uh, List Perfectly when I use List Perfectly. There's no B-Dratty on any sites except for eBay, so that's why B-Dratty is not an option here, so I can't click it. Again, my, this is my computer that's taking forever. It's not actually auto posher. Um, yeah, because I'm streaming. Hang on, let's try that again. What's up, brother? My computer's running slow. No, don't run slow. <laughs> We're timing this computer. Stop. Uh, let me try Poshmark really quick and see if that works. Hopefully this doesn't happen every time. Mm, stupid computer. Come on. Come on. Give it to me. Give it to me. Mm -mm -mm. You price higher on Poshmark? I price everything the same prices across all platforms. Same prices across all platforms. Let me see if I refresh if it fixes it. Mm -mm -mm. Man, this has never happened. Oh, there it goes. Whew, I'm about to say this has never happened. Why is it happening when I'm on live? Just uh, started cross posting Depop's price. Regular things are selling. I haven't yet um, tried Depop. Um, I've been hearing good things about Depop from people who have been cross listing. So, yeah. Why do you hate Depop? Because I don't like you. Um, same thing. B Dratty's not a polo, not a brand on Poshmark, so we don't have to worry about putting it in. That's why it's good that Poshmark is um, is not required. Um, this looks good. I might change this to, this is going to be changed to masters and we're going to hit list. Yeah, I keep the price the same. What's up, um, Skittles? I keep the price the same across all platforms um, because I charge shipping on eBay now. So um, it's just easier um, to just keep everything the same instead of worry about changing prices. Any good Mercari? I sold two things on Mercari actually within the last like two hours. Um, I'm probably going to sell more because it seems like as soon as I list things over to Mercari, it seems to sell. So as soon as I list, I get a bunch of sales on Mercari. I, I'm sure it's not the algorithm. I'm sure it's just I'm at the top of search. So that's why it's doing that. Thank you, ACG. Everything's in. Correct. Super simple. It's how easy it is to cross list. I would go over and verify that all these listings are cross listed, but trust me, they are. At the end of this, I'll show you that everything is cross listed correctly. We're just listing, just listing away. Again, the faster computer you have, the faster this will be. But um, obviously I'm listening. And this got put in correctly that time, so we don't have to worry about it. <coughs> it got put in as Polo Ralph Lauren and not Lauren Ralph Lauren. This size is a 2XB. Um, big and tall sizes always come in incorrectly. Because um, on eBay, it's 2XB. On Mercari, it's big 2X. And then Poshmark, there is no big sizes. Um, there's just 2XL and 2XLT. So I opt to just use the 2XL version when I'm cross-listing cross big and tall sizes. So see, there's just a 2XL. If I go through here and go to the tall, there's no B sizes. So what I could do is I could add my own, but I just put in 2XL for that. They can read the title. Her people, um, some Mercari now have the pay fees, like pillows for $120. I know you sold that pillow for good money today, Trisha. Um, those are all correct. Good, good to go. That's insane that you sold a pillow for 120 bucks. Who's out here buying pillows in this economy for 120 bucks? <laughs> That's insane. That's insane. All right, that one's listed. Everything's good. Again, 77 items is what we're shooting to cross list on this live. 77 items. I don't think Grayson is a brand in Mercari. Um, so we're just gonna leave this blank 
and then we're just gonna hit list. I wish Mercari had size. Also, Mercari doesn't have redress shirts. It doesn't have like certain sizes for dress shirts, which is annoying too. All the other sites have them, but we don't. It's a set of three to be fair. Yeah, that's still good. Shirts, polos, Grayson, everything's good. Cross list. Next up, Lululemon women's t-shirt. Lululemon t-shirt brand again didn't come in. Happens every time with Lululemon, so you just gotta type it out and then you hit list. That one's listed. Masuk almost sold yesterday. That Masuk got an offer on it, but the person never, I countered and the person didn't accept it. So that's clearly gonna sell fast. Facebook gives you Roosevelt's ads on this live. It's probably because you say Roosevelt's a lot in your house. And now they're clearly giving you ads. This is a heavier item. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually up this to two pounds just to be safe. Um, so that way I don't have to, you know, relist it on Mercari after it sells. Boom, boom, boom. Suck, cardigans, everything's good. So that's one page down, three pages to go. Oh, never mind, I got these up here. I forgot about these two. Um, men's Carhartt ca uh, cargo shorts, those are done. I know, you're already a customer. One of their biggest customers. How many people have we got watching? 33 people, what's up everybody? Cargo shorts listed. So again, Auto Posture is not out currently for everybody. If you already had Auto Posture before, you can sign up for the Cross Lister. Um, if not, if you wanted to wait, Auto Posture comes out hopefully next Wednesday. That's the day she's shooting for is the 17th. She said 17th by the latest she's shooting for 18th. Um, but she said she should have everything together by um, Wednesday to let everybody on. Um, so that should be pretty cool. Everybody will be able to hop over to Auto Posture, see how easy it is. There is a... Um, a trial version so you can try the trial version and she will be releasing the um, only cross lister version so if you didn't want the automation for whatever reason and you just wanted the cross lister um, you can buy that um, on Wednesday or Thursday whatever day she releases it Heller bros those two I those two the reason they were already cross listed because I made a video yesterday short form piece of content that I'm gonna put out as soon as it's ready to go why do you not put in style codes I don't believe you need to put in style codes um, I haven't heard anybody that actually has said that style codes give them more sales. So I don't take the time to put the style codes in. I think it's a waste. Um, in the chat, if you guys put in style codes and you feel like it increases your sales, let me know. But I asked this question on the last, that's why it's optional. I asked this question on the last live and people, t everybody pretty much said no style codes. Um, it's just an extra thing. It's like, it's like eBay, if you were to put in all of the um, information you filled out every single item specific that's not required that's just a huge waste of time sure it'll boost you in search a little bit but I don't believe it's necessary at all what is a style code it's basically basically like using hashtags like for example this one would be hashtag shorts or hashtag this or, or hashtag summer stuff like that to bring people in I, I don't think it's I don't think it's worth it so that's why I don't do it I don't I don't even worry about it That one's getting listed. I think that one, I did put that in one in wrong. So we're going to go back and fix that really quick. I put that as a women's. It brought it in as a women's. It brought it in as a men's on um, Poshmark. So we're going to go back and fix that. So I think you click this and you click edit item. And it'll bring up all where it's listed. And then we're going to go over to Mercari. We're going to go to all men's shorts. Um, casual shorts it's going to change it and then we're going to change the size to 34 so you can bulk edit from this page if you if you make a mistake like I did so this will obviously slow down the time a little bit I should have been paying attention 9 by 11 by 2 and then we're going to hit update item now it's going to update all those items so if we made a mistake on all of them we would just go to that page and it would update everything for us where are your daily clear bags from? Um, Brittany, if you go to my pin post on Facebook, pin top left-hand corner, um, it'll be in that link tree, pinned to the top left-hand corner. And you go to the products we use on a daily basis, it has all the clear bags we use. All right, back to cross-listing. Boom, little, little mistake on my part. Cost us, a, cost us a minute. But we're almost, we're like halfway done with this page already. Um, swim trunk size are 36. They might not have 36 in here. 
Um, I guess we can add our own for this if we want to. We can just put in 36 and then hit list. No problem. Yeah, we have all the products we use, including the um, regular shipping bags too. The shipping bags will be under the gyro pack link and there's a discount code. Um, the white bags are from Amazon, or the clear bags, sorry, are from Amazon. So you get, um, go through my Amazon link tree. It doesn't cost you any more money. Um, it's just that affiliate uh, affiliate link. So if you have Prime, you, know, you still get free shipping and all that. All those should be Prime listings as well. So, yeah. Tori Richard, XL, everything looks good. We're gonna list. Yeah, and the reason it doesn't bring in ha style tags, if you were to list this on Poshmark and use style tags, when you download the listing, it will bring over your style tags. I just don't do it on eBay. So um, that's uh, eBay doesn't require it. So that's why it's not brought over. So if you do all your listings on Poshmark and now you're moving your stuff to eBay, um, it'll work for you. Um, when you first get AutoPosher 2, download and sync all of your listings. If you have like, let's say like a thousand listings, it's gonna take it about 15 to 20 minutes to download everything. Um, so just give it some time to download. Pull by Ralph Lauren, there it is. Um, but once it's done and you just download like five to 10 listings every day when you're doing your cross listing, it only takes like a minute to bring everything in. What's up, Bobby? This is a really rare wool Woolrich um, shacket. I don't think the size, I guess it did come in. And this is a men's, I believe. Yeah, it's a men's. So it brought it in the wrong category. So we'll just have to change that really quick. And the size probably won't be in there for Mercari. Jackets. I'm gonna put this as, it's not a fleece jacket. Um, let me put it as wool. Yeah, that's right. Size is 16. So I'm just gonna put one size. Hopefully they read the title because um, it's not that. And I'm actually gonna increase the shipping to three pounds because um, I know this is a heavier piece. And as you can see, when you change the weights really quick, the weights adjust to whatever you put in and it puts in the shipping. So that updates to UPS and then you list. So easy peasy. It updates everything for you as you're putting in your information. Um, if you download your information correctly, it'll all be in there for shipping correct already. Um, so make sure you're putting in your proper shipping. Again, the size won't be in there. I'm gonna type in my own size for um, Poshmark, um, even though it's not gonna help with search, but that way they have it in there um, just in case the buyer complains that I didn't put in the right size. Um, Athleta, women's tank tops, size 34. This is, a, this is a bikini top. I don't even know what category this goes into women's. Um, swimwear. Uh, I'm just going to put it as one piece. <laughs> I, I don't know. This is a Caleb listing, clearly. Um, 34. It says 34, so I'm putting in 5XL. I don't know if that's correct, but oh well. It's a woman's, it's a woman's item. They'll, they'll enjoy how I just put that in. Um, Kayla should have cross-listed this because I have no clue what I'm doing. Look at that next piece. Um, 34, everything looks good. I'm going to leave it as a sports bra because uh, they'll read the title. They'll know where it is. Next up, um, Ralph Lauren Polo Bear Crew Neck. Really nice piece. Um, that one's going in correctly, so we're just going to hit list. Again, this is how easy it is to cross list with Auto Posture. You're literally just clicking buttons. Instead of opening separate pages and all that, you're just literally opening a page, finishing the listing. Most of the time, everything's correct. There's very few instances, as you can see, that I have to go in and change things. Um, it's usually just size or brand that you have to change. Everything else should be in there correctly. So I know it's not a 5XL, Felix. I, I don't, Mercari has such weird sizes like um, dress shirts. If you ever put a dress shirt in Mercari, I don't believe they have number sizes for dress shirts, which make absolutely um, no sense. So that's Mercari for you. That one's listed. See, that just changed my brand to Lauren Ralph Lauren. Um, it does that every once in a while. Little sleepies, pajama set, that one's listed. Also too, I'm gonna to show you something when we get to the top of the page that's gonna help you guys with your listing process as you guys bring in listings. Um, because I didn't do this at first, and I had to go and find listings, and I didn't realize that you could sort your listings by newest, new, newly synced, which really, really helps out the uh, listing process. So I should have included that in my YouTube video. I don't know if I did. Um, and also there's a full guide on YouTube for how auto posture works. Um, if you haven't watched that video yet and you're confused a little bit after I get done with this, that whole video will explain all the parts of auto posture, including the cross, the cross listing, the share tool, 
the realist tool, all of that will be up there. So go watch that video if you haven't already after this live, if you're really interested in auto posher. That one's listed. All right. <clears throat> Krunak 2XL, list the Poshmark. And if you guys have any questions, feel free to drop them in the chat. I'll try to answer as many as I can while we're um, cross listing. This is a jogger, so oh, it's sleepwear pants, that's why. I'll try to answer as many as I can while I am cross listing. If not, just hang out and see when I get done. Because we're like almost halfway done at this point, getting pretty close to halfway done. I hope this sells fast on Mercari. My last one I just listed sold super fast. They already sold today. I think I cross-listed it yesterday and it sold today. And the reason I gotta get this done is because we go on vacation tomorrow and I don't wanna have to do this when I get back from vacation. I want everything to be done, all the items to be put away. Mom's coming in tomorrow to work, so she'll be able to put away most of the inventory. So basically we just come back to a clean work area um, and we can get right back into listing on, on Monday. We should be back by like midday Monday. PLR, blazers, everything's good. List it. Last two on this page, and then we just have two more pages, and then we're done. Pendleton. I did put that as two pounds because these are typically a little bit heavier, so that way it goes UPS. I don't use FedEx. I think FedEx, somebody mentioned in one of my um, YouTube videos that FedEx and UPS. I guess are the same price on um, on Mercari, but to be honest, I trust FedEx, uh, or trust UPS a lot more than I trust FedEx. Oh, I know why my internet slows, because I'm on my other internet, so. Appreciate you, Jennifer. I hooked up to my other internet, so that's why it's slow. Three day clues, oh, why not seven? Because I can't leave the business for seven days, Felix. Also, we have kids, and could you imagine leaving the kids home with mom for seven days? That'd be miserable for her. Um, why, do you put measurements for all shirts in the description? Yes, I do. Um, I'll show you what the description looks like on the next. Uh, here, let's do a shirt really quick. Here, we'll do this one. So the description says it has a pit to pit and a top to bottom on this one. This this is a windbreaker and it doesn't have a shoulder measurement. So that's why you don't see a shoulder measurement for that one. But yeah, pit to pit, um, top to bottom. We do hanging photos, so we can't take um, photos of the measurements. I'm just coming um, to your live. Is auto posture available all now? It's available next Wednesday is what she's shooting for. As soon as you see my short form piece of content um, about auto posture, that's when it's released. But she's she's aiming for next Wednesday. If I said Tuesday, I meant Wednesday. She's aiming for next Wednesday um, auto posture. If you have auto posture already, if you had the um, $35 plan before this all came out, you can, you can upgrade right now. Um, but if you didn't, then you have to wait till Wednesday. That's what I would say. You could reach out to her and ask, but I, to be honest, I would just wait till Wednesday when it's fully released. But yeah, this is how easy it's, it is to work. And I'll, I'll make sure that Wednesday, I'll probably have a live um, also going over questions and everything. It's gonna be a lot slower than this one. So you guys can like watch how it works. You guys can ask your questions because um, it's a completely new kind of software for most people. So there are gonna be a lot of questions. Um, so I'll be live that night, answering questions, hanging out, doing some cross listing. So no, I'm new to the idea of cross posting. <clears throat> yes, it is, a, it is a game changer when you cross post, especially when something is this easy to use. There's no such brand as Freefly on Mercari. So we're just gonna leave that blank. Um, figure I'd just say that before somebody says you forgot to put the brand in. Um, there should be Freefly on Poshmark, I believe. Yep, free flies on Poshmark. So we just hit that button, we cross list. And if you have like 50 listings, to be honest, you probably can cross list all 50 listings within a, an hour. Even somebody who's slow can cross list all 50 listings to all three platforms in most likely an hour. Like we've been live for 20 minutes right now and we're halfway done with the third page. And we just have one more page to go. So. We're like 50-ish listings in right now, if I did my math correctly in my head. That's Capri Pants, put in. So you should be able to get everything done within an hour, um, even somebody going slow. That one's listed. I got some water sakes, I knew I'd be talking a bunch. 
Billy Blitzer dresses. This one, I hate this, that Mercari makes you do this. You have to put the dress, dress occasion. I don't know what the hell dress this is. I'm gonna put A-line, that sounds good to me. That one's listed. That's good for the slow people out there. That's good for people like you. Felix, did you just hump, cop, oh, you just hopped over from YouTube and now you're on Facebook? You're, you're bored without me. You know Surf's is on, uh, he's on Fortnite right now. He's waiting for you, Felix. He wants you on. Um, hopefully this gets put in correctly. Yep, that's good. Because I don't want to have to find that on Mercari. <coughs> Tell Surf's if you hop on that I literally have 10 more minutes and we'll be done. 10 minutes. That one's cross-listed. We'll hop over to here. This puts in a sweater, polo sweater. I guess that's fine. That doesn't really, I guess it should be a crew neck sweater, right? Yeah, there you go. Crew neck sweater, that one's listed. Listed a bunch of brand new items today. Um, actually, we listed 54 items today. So some of these that uh, have been sitting and re ready to be cross-listed for the last few days, but we didn't get around to cross-listing them. So I figured I'd get it all done before the cruise. Why do I hear Joey? He should be in bed. Here we go, dress occasion again. I'm just clicking A line. I don't know what this is. Why do I hear Joey up? Uh, I'd bring him in here, but he probably is not fully clothed. All right, that one's listed. Ted Baker, brand new with tags. Pick this up in a local bulk buy. This is a men's dress shirt, so it's got put into the wrong category. We'll go men's, tops, and then butt front. The size on this is seven, um, which I believe is a, an XL. I can change that later if it's not. I'll go back in and change that later if it's not. Nine by 11 by two, Mercari shipping, ground advantage, boom. All right listed going over to Poshmark again the size won't be put in correctly that's why it got put into women's because it's a size 7 that makes sense it confused auto posture and thought it was a women's piece um, button-down shirts I'm gonna change that to an XL Ted Baker listed so every once in a while you will have to change a, a few things the AI picks it up like that AI picked it up as a women's piece that's why I changed it this is a really, really good shirt. The uh, Canali shirt, this is a tuxedo shirt. Always look out for those. They sell for a lot more than a regular Canali dress shirt. So I think I listed that one for $89 or $79.99. It's a good one. Pull Ralph Lauren, wool jacket, everything looks good. I'll list it. Bring it over to Poshmark. Everything should be in, put in correctly. We're gonna list it. Oh, I gotta change that to, from sh polos to um, to jacket. This should be not shirts, but it should be jackets. And it should be a. Um, do they have a shirt? Oh, shirt jacket. I messed it up again. Boom. Pull Ralph Lauren large update item. Now that's gonna fix it on um, Poshmark for me. Back to inventory. We're on the Burberry Brit. It's a polo, Burberry Brit, everything's good. Boom, list. So again, as you guys are watching, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. If not, you just wanna watch and see how this works. Feel free to just chill out. Hopefully you guys are getting some uh, listings done too. After I'm done with this, I'm gonna go play some Fortnite with the boys for a little bit and then I'm gonna ship out my items and then I'm gonna go to bed I try to go to bed early because we got to wake up at 6 a.m. and if you guys know me I don't wake up early at all and then I got to drive all the way to the other coast everything's good the reason I didn't put Johnny O in Mercari because Johnny O is not a brand in Mercari so I don't <clears throat> worry about putting that in Banana Republic men's button front tops that one's listed also, one thing I'll mention too, once I get done with this listing, you'll notice this little orange thing. Um, that's to verify the listings. If you watched my um, YouTube video, you already know that. The reason that's important to make sure all your listings do not have this little thing right here is if this item sells on eBay, 
it will not get pulled off of auto posture because this is not selected. So you haven't told auto posture that you verified that this listing is correct. So it will not auto sales detect. Um, this one will. So if this sold right now on, um, on eBay, it would automatically pull it off eBay um, for it. Why not the brand? It just, um, Mercari has some brands that they don't have put into their system. Um, you can request Mercari to put in the brand and I've done that a few times and it never works. Um, they never put in the brand. So uh, you just don't fill it out. That's why it's optional. Um, to put it in, but Johnny O is one of those brands that aren't available on um, Mercari. Ralph Lauren, this is a nice one too. This is a polo bear um, Ralph Lauren shirt. It's a nice one. Uh, there's a couple brands like that. Um, and there's a couple brands that are different than on eBay. So when you import your listings, sometime when you go to cross list, um, it won't work like well, this one is just because it's Ralph Lauren and there's so many Ralph Lauren. So the AI picks it up the best one it feels fit and it always ends up defaulting to Laura and Ralph Lauren for some reason. Last two for this page and then we only have one more page to go. One more page, is, one more page of 20 and then we're done. So we basically have done 57 listings already on this live. And we've listed them to two sites. So that's 114 listings that we've done in total on this live. This is a Tommy Bahama, I think it's a men's, right? Yeah, it's a men's. And at the end of this month, I'll probably start moving some stuff over to Depop and give Depop a try. And then I might make a um, YouTube video on Depop once I get the hang of it, because I know a lot of people are thinking about moving their stuff to Depop, but I've never used it before. So I probably will make a video on that. Hopefully this is put in correctly. It's not put in correctly. It's a shapewear. Where the hell, what category does this go into? Women's, women's underwear, maybe? Nope. What category is this? Tops, blouses. I'm just gonna put in women's other. Nope, there is no women's other. Freak. I'm putting it under underwear, other. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what category this goes into. This needs to be uh, that needs to be an item that Kayla cross lists and not me because I have no clue where that's supposed to go. It's probably put in correctly on auto, on uh, Poshmark, I would assume. Yeah, it's put in properly on Poshmark, but probably Mercari doesn't have a section for that. Um, yeah, that was a little awkward. It's probably going to put in as Polo again, so we're going to change that to Crew Neck. Everything else is correct. We're good to go. And I love it that it just auto defaults to UPS. It puts all that information in for me. So I don't have to worry about selecting my shipping. Um, it changes it all for me. It tells me which one's the best. And it's really good for me because I have a UPS store like literally right down the street. So if anything sells, see no free fly. If we type in free fly, it won't pick up. There's no such brand as free fly. So you just leave that blank. Um, but if something sells on UPS for me, it's super easy to drop off. Um, it takes me like two minutes to go drop something off. So I'm not really mad about this um, whole UPS thing. Um, and on Mercari, if it sells, remember there's no fees. So stuff has been selling very, very well on Mercari for me. So I've been making more money on Mercari than I ever have before. So it's really great that Auto Posture came out with this cross list here because there was a point this year that I almost stopped listing on Mercari. And Auto Posture came out and now I'm listing there again. Let's get the... But a turtleneck pullover, good. Give it a second to load. Letta, everything should be put in. This is a sweater, right? Mm, she got this out of. She's got this as a shirt, though. That's probably why I brought it in as a long sleeve. I'm gonna leave it. I don't think it really matters on Poshmark. As long as your title is good, they'll see what it is. Women's shorts, women's khaki shorts. Boom, that one's listed. A lot of these items are ladies items that um, I don't typically list. I don't think it's, we should put those as cargos, not high-waisted shorts. Almost done. Polo Ralph Lauren is probably going to put it as a polo again. We're going to change that to crew neck and then we're going to list it. And this one should be put in correctly. 
crew neck, large, that one's listed. When I go on vacation, I'm probably gonna leave Mercari and Poshmark off vacation mode because we'll be back on Monday, but I'm probably gonna turn eBay on vacation mode starting, uh, actually, I'm probably gonna put it on Sunday and Monday. Actually, I'm probably gonna just put it on Monday. That's what I'll do, I'll probably put it on Monday. Do I just put on Monday? No, I probably should put on Friday, but I don't want sales to stop. Maybe I won't do vacation mode. I don't want sales to stop. Obviously you still can get sales on eBay when you're not on, or when you're on vacation mode, you can still allow sales to happen. But typically when somebody sees that you're on vacation and they go to buy an item, um, it might prompt them not to buy, buy that item, it might cause them not to buy it. So I don't want that to happen. We should be back in enough time on Monday to ship my orders. Um, so I'll probably just leave my store off vacation mode. I'll make a decision about that tonight. That one's listed. Outdoor voices. Last few that we have left. Nat Nast, size large, everything's good. How much time are we sitting at right now? We're at 34 minutes. So we're at 34 minutes, which are 30, we're at 36 minutes, which would be, we started four minutes in, so it's taken us 32 minutes to cross list 77 items, which is basically an item every 30 seconds, which isn't bad at all. If I wouldn't have made those two mistakes, it probably would have been even faster. And of course my computer's lagging up a little bit because I'm on live, so it's slowing me down a little bit. But either way, that's pretty good. 30 seconds per cross list. Little sleepies, that's good. Vineyard Vines button down shirt. Everything's good, Vineyard Vines 2XL. I'm gonna leave it at 15 ounces. I was gonna raise it to two pounds, but I'll keep it at 15. I think that's pretty close to what it'll be. That one's done. <clears throat> Like I said, when Auto Posture comes out next week, I'll do a live where it's a lot slower. Um, I'll be able to talk you guys through it, answer your questions. Today, I just want to see how fast we can get all these done. And it makes me do this too, because I'm on live in front of you guys, so I can't stop. I have to keep going. Um, so yeah, it, makes, it forces me to do this. I'm probably going to do these lives more often too. Not with as many items though. That, that item that I literally just cross-listed, this charcoal one, is it on this page? This one right here already has a like on um, Mercari. See you, Skittles. That one is listed, three pounds, boom. Last few, last few. How many more we got? Like five more after this? Both of those are the same, so they'll be easy to do. It's done, pull Ralph Lauren. Bet you these pull Ralph Lauren sell fast on Mercari because they're new. Mercari is a really good place for polo. I actually bought a polo Ralph Lauren piece off Mercari because I had like $50 in credits from people signing up through my links. So I just used it to buy myself a polo Ralph Lauren polo bear sweater. <clears throat> All right, last few. Let's go. And then I get to go play some Fortnite with the boys and then ship out my orders and then go to bed. It's done. Pull Ralph Lauren, shirt hoodies, done. Eileen Fisher cardigan. It's cardigan, Eileen Fisher, it's set to two pounds, so we're good. Good thing is when if you haven't cross listed a Poshmark, the good thing is you don't got to worry about shipping when you cross list the Poshmark. You just got to worry about your item being put a, put in the correct category. As you can see, there's no shipping right here. So if you've never shipped the Poshmark or if you never listed the Poshmark and you use Auto Posture for the first time and you don't see that, it's good because you can ship up to five pounds on um, Poshmark um, at a time with the Poshmark label. So don't have to worry about the uh, shipping. 
last cross list. Everything's good. Boom. All right, let's see how long that took. Once this one finishes, of course, this one's going to take the longest to finish. <laughs> the very last one is taking the longest to finish. Oh, come on. <laughs> We're on the last one. Uh, let me see. Um, we're at 40 minutes and 12 seconds total. So 40 minutes and 12 seconds, which means it took us 36 minutes to cross list 74 items. If this last one would cross list, let me refresh the page. It probably did. Yep, it already did. We're good. Oh no, it didn't. Let's do it again. Damn, we added a minute on for that one. Boom, now it's cross listed, but not too bad. 30 something minutes. Um, Technically, it's 70, what did I say? There were 76 items or 77 items? No, 77 items when we first started. That's 114 cross lists. 114 divided by, what did I say, 36. I don't know the math. Why am I trying to do math this late at night? It's like, that's like uh, 30 seconds per list, right? I think that's right, chat. I think it's 30 seconds per list, right around that, right around that time slot. So not too bad. That's how easy it is. If I was on list perfectly, trust me, it would be taking me a lot longer to do that. That's one reason why I decided to go with auto posture. The seamless inventory function, you're able to go through inventory and see everything. Also, when your item gets delisted and relisted from um, eBay, you do not break the link. Before when I was using auto posture and list perfectly and something got delisted, it would break the link um, with list perfectly and I wouldn't be able to use auto sales detection. Now with auto posture, even if your items link gets broken multiple times, auto posture will re-input the link for you and you will still get auto uh, sales detection. That was a key reason I decided to push auto posture and decided to go with auto posture. So I hope you guys enjoyed the live. Again, if you're interested in auto posture, I do have a link. I'll put it in the description of this video on YouTube, but it isn't linked in all my bios. So feel free to go to Instagram or wherever you want to go. Um, you get um, $5 off your first month. You can also use code Kway Shop at checkout. If you don't want to use the link, just put my code in. There is a free trial. Just again, remember auto posture is not currently out yet for the uh, cross listing feature. So it will be out hopefully next Wednesday. As soon as you see that short form piece of content that I put out that explains how auto posture works, that's when it's released. I'll also put out like a, um, a post on probably my stories and stuff like that. So when's your whatnot? Oh yeah, whatnot show, not this weekend because obviously we're going to be away this weekend. The following weekend, I already have them ready to go. Bookmark both shows. We have a full giveaway show on Friday. We're not selling anything. It's literally just all giveaways on Friday. And then Saturday, we're going to have a really, really, really big show, um, really good items. So make sure you go bookmark those uh, two shows. Full giveaway show on Friday. Do not miss that show. We're going to give away shoes. We're going to give away all brand new attack stuff. I got tons of brand new attack stuff in, and we're just going to give it away. It's probably going to be like anywhere between seven to 10 giveaways. We're just going to hang out, ask you guys some questions, um, and do all giveaways. It's a thank you guys for a full year on whatnot. Um, so make sure you bookmark that show and then go bookmark Saturday show because we're going to come back with some crazy pieces on Saturday. It's going to be our first show back in two weeks. So we're going to have a lot of fun and we'll probably do a lot of giveaways on that show too. So I'm going to go ahead and head off. I appreciate you guys um, and I'll see you guys next Tuesday, next Tuesday or maybe next Monday, depending on when I get back um, either of those days. So I'll catch you guys then.